so I'm still working on the octopus and I ended up actually coloring it in after I inked it. Um, but I wanted to show you uh, something that I do with pen drawings. It's actually not good at all for your markers, um, but it looks kind of cool. You can see this area in here is shaded. So what I did was some really light cross hatching with the pen. And then um, if you color over it with the marker, the marker will basically make the pen bleed and it keeps a little bit of the cross hatching, um, but you can use that for shading. So I basically just will sort of do it a little bit in this part, draw some really light lines, right? And then go over it with your marker. See how that just sort of spreads it out? And um, it really isn't good for the marker. You end up having to sort of color off all the stain on a blank piece of paper, but it looks kind of cool. Um, and it will actually make your initial lines bleed, so a lot of times also I have to uh, take the pen and sort of redraw those initial lines because they'll sort of bleed out. Um, but again, it's kind of a cool effect. So for anyone that's interested, um, that's how I did it. Right, and you can sort of go through and add shadows that way. Um, and another thing that you can do is basically just keep recoloring over a certain area with the marker, right, like this. And you have to sort of continuously do it, but that's sort of a nice um, effect as well. And you can see, well, hopefully you can see um, on the video, I've left some areas white on here. So basically, the more sort of shading I do and add, the more those um, lighter areas are going to stand out um, and have this look much more <clears throat> sort of dimensional, uh, which is good. So I'm basically just going to keep reworking this with sort of shadows and highlights and then eventually um, I'll go in and, and sort of redraw the initial pen lines to kind of clean it up. Um, and then I would also like to add a background to this as well. I don't know what that's going to be yet, but uh, we'll get there eventually. So this part is really just sort of a lot of um, sort of reworking some details. But it's also kind of the fun part because it really sort of starts to come together, hopefully. Right, so I'm just going to keep working like that until I'm happy with it.